Hello and welcome to Action One. Today we're going to be doing a quick overview of how to deploy applications to the Action One console. We have two main routes we can take for this. We can either from our endpoints section, select an endpoint or endpoints, and say deploy app. And from here, we can search for the application that we wish to deploy. We do a quick search, we can see multiple versions of Adobe Reader in this instance that can be selected and pushed. The other option is to make use of the Action One App Store. Uh, here, we're going to see a collection of built in applications that Action One is managing for you and making sure that you have the latest version of said applications. This also ties into our third party batch management as well. Now, to deploy out these applications, all we need to do is just put a checkbox next to the applications that we want to push, say deploy. And from here, Action One is going to load in our applications, ask us how we want to handle our automatic reboots. We can select the endpoints you want to target. We can say all rebuilt groups or individual endpoints. And then we can choose when we wish to execute said push. If we want, we can also create our own applications in the Action One App Store for deployment, which are going to fall under custom applications. You can see here in my library, I have quite a few. And by doing so, we can pretty easily create a new application. We're able to have multiple versions over time because this again ties into patching. And by adding in our version numbers, we can quite easily go to the installation tab here, pick MSI, pick EXE, and point to either a UNC path that's on premise or the more popular option, upload to the actual cloud. From there, we just need to specify our install switches for our EXE or additional switches for our MSI, hit save, and we'll be able to deploy this through our portal. We can also do additional actions and add in additional steps, such as reboot scripts and the like that can be performed before, after install or uninstall. With that being said, though, that is a quick overview of the Action One capability to perform application deployment. Thank you very much.